If you're working with multiple instances of VS Code, you can use the switch window command to quickly swap between them. Here, for example, I have two VS Code instances open, one for the main VS Code repository, and then another one for the VS Code docs repository. And with this particular window set up right here, I can actually just quickly swap back and forth between them just by clicking. But oftentimes that's not the case if they're maximized or if you have quite a few VS Code instances running, it might not be so simple. So let's use the switch window command for that instead. To get started, I'm just gonna open the command palette and then say switch window. And when I run this command, you'll see this quick pick here that has a list of all the current VS Code windows. What this is displaying, it's telling us that this is the currently active window over here. This is the folder that is opened. And then this is the file that is currently focused um, or currently active within that window. Again, for the VS Code docs repository, here we have the VS Code docs folder open, and then it is focused on the readme file. To swap over to that docs window, I can just click on it or hit enter to accept the current suggestion in that quick pick there. And I've now swapped over to this window. This command is also bound to control W on Mac. So if I press control W there, it opens up the switch window command, um, just kind of a convenient keyboard shortcut. And you can also set up a key binding for this on Windows and Linux. This is really helpful though, if you have like quite a few VS Code instances open. So I'm just gonna open a few different things here. So we'll go open configuration sample um, and this thing as well. Um, and now I can use the switch window command here. So switch window. And you'll see this complete list of all the windows that I have open. I could then filter down this list just by typing. So I could say VS Code and see all the things that have VS Code either in the open file name or in the open folder name, and then swap between them very quickly like this. So kind of a convenient way to help you manage your windows and work with multiple instances of VS Code.